Hey Bethel, it's Pastor Chris here and Pastor Wendy. Officially day one, we are joining you for our update video this week. And we just wanna make sure you're aware of a few things that are all about what's happening at Bethel. And the first thing I'm gonna let Wendy tell you about. Bethesda School, you probably remember that we talked about this, I believe just last week. Uh, over 300 kids to sponsor and they're about halfway through there. So this is the challenge. The challenge is to not only sponsor a child, but maybe sponsor two kids if you have two kids or if you have grandchildren or if you are an aunt or if you are an uncle it's a good idea to sponsor as many kids as you can so as many kids as possible can go to school forty dollars go to the Bethel homepage and you can find your ways to support them there or the on, the give, give on the give, give page give page the there link will go. be below and I think too a lot of us are our kids are starting to go back to school this week some are starting next week and it's just a good way to just remember that kids all around the world need to go to school and uh, we can be a part of helping them do that. I'm going to be talking about sharpened pencils on Sunday. Sharpened, sharpened pencils. pencils. There you go. For sure. Um, there are two other ministry updates I want to make sure you're aware of. I mean, you can look, please make sure you're getting our emails at home. I mean, youth ministry is starting up. We heard on Sunday from uh, one of our leaders for our Taekwondo ministry. You can see the link below, but they're looking for some leaders and volunteers and their registration's opening really soon. So if you'd like to get involved with Taekwondo, please reach out. You could reach out to us in the church and we could get you in contact with Glenn Ostroff and Joanne as well. Um, and the other thing I want to mention is pancakes and praise. So young, our young adults are getting together for a worship, a worship night uh, on September 10th. You can see details below. And uh, if you're a young adult, we want to see you there. This is completely created for you, a space where you can kind of eat, uh, connect with some people your age. And we want to also have the focus that like God is with us. That's what the worship is about. And so we hope that that would be uh, something you would like to come to. We'd love to see you there, invite a friend. And uh, last thing, and we introduced the video by acknowledging that Wendy is now on the video as a pastor, which is true. And so one of the things I asked Wendy is this, as a close out for our update video. Wendy, what is a hope for you, the hope that you have coming into this work and this call that you have at Bethel as a pastor of congregational care and discipleship? You know, Bethel is a community that I love and have loved for a long time. So my hope would be this. My hope would be that not only are we drawn together as a community um, more and more, that we are a vibrant community of uh, prayer and of seeking God's will and digging into the Word. Uh, those of you that have been on the Bible app with us this year, we're on day 260, whatever it is, and it has been an enriching thing. So that's my hope for Bethel. We love you. We look forward to seeing you in worship this Sunday and hope there's ways that we can connect with you before then. Have a good week. Bye, Bethel.